marked up with war paint and ready for battle. A lot of gunfire back and forth between the two. Tonight, the family feud that turned into shots fired. And that is where we begin tonight at 10. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jolene Chaney. That family member with the war paint is nursing a gunshot wound in jail. News 4's Natalie Clydesdale is on the night beat. Natalie. Well, Jolene, this is Wade Womack, and prosecutors want him held without bond, saying he's, quote, violently unstable, and they fear he could endanger his family like this again. A lot of gunfire back and forth between the two. A chaotic shootout between a Yukon family. There was an altercation inside the home at some point. Court documents reveal after the initial fight, Wade Womack left the home, promising to return and kill one of his family members. In fact, did come back. Allegedly with black paint around his eyes. Womack told investigators, quote, he was one-tenth Choctaw and it is his death war paint. And he, quote, knew there was going to be a fight and wanted to be prepared. And for whatever reason, began firing rounds at the home uh, while while several people were inside. Court records saying Womack fired several rounds from a rifle from the driver's seat of his truck in the driveway. Meanwhile, family members inside started shooting back. Thankfully, no one was hit while they were in there. Uh, the suspect was struck in the ear as some family members ended up returning fire from inside the home. OCPD says his injuries were non-life-threatening. Womack charged with three counts of assault and battery with a deadly weapon and use of a vehicle in discharge of a weapon and one count of planning to perform an act of violence. Womack is scheduled to be in court Wednesday morning.